Feel like the creative juices are flowing through my head all over <laughs> again. What's up, guys? Hey, guys. Happy, what is it, a Monday? What is in the way? What's in Why the way? Why is this light so low? I don't know. Not good. All right, so let's get down to business. This is a grilled cheese tomato soup bread bowl. I was creative. I was really creative. I think this is going to be delicious. I think it's going to be delicious too. I think that's going to be really good. Yeah, calories are under 2,000. Uh, I had something else to go in there, but it was 400 calories. So I, I nixed that and I just went with the basic grilled cheese uh, tomato soup pasta bread bowl. I think it's going to be a winner. I really do. I think so too. I feel like you need like a knife with that. <laughs> what I was going to do is I was going to use the fork and then at the very end scoop the bread, the, the pasta with the... With the... Yeah. Yeah. Almost like garlic bread and, gotcha. and, and pasta. I mean that would make sense. Hello Marie. Who are you girl? So I have breakfast stuffed peppers. You want to show them? Yeah. So I have breakfast stuffed peppers with some tater tots and some ketchup. Um, in my stuffed peppers, there are scrambled eggs, um, red peppers diced, diced onions. Here it is. Um, yeah, me too. I thought I heard somebody coming down the stairs. Yeah. Um, turkey sausage, crumbled bacon. And uh, I topped it with some more bacon, some cheese sauce, and some jalapenos. Bah. Hello, Pat. Hello, Tessa. How's everybody's oh. Monday going? Oh, you need some milk? <sighs> There's your cup. I'll get a cup. Get your cup. Huh? Okay. I'll, get it. I'll just get a new cup. Oh, I think I washed this cup. I, that's why I said I just got Hello, Denise. Hello, Saul's mom. Nice to see you guys. Everything Upstairs. looks sounds amazing. What's for dinner? Oh, fuzzy <sighs> bastard. Oh, Pete, can you well, want to tell Pete what I have while I go get Yeah, this? can you take care of this too? Because it's kind of in the way. What is it? Your um, spinach shake, what's left. So, Jamie has in his bread bowl tomato soup with pasta with a grilled cheese on top. Hello, Chastity. Hello, Shannon. I have a feeling his dinner's gonna be really good. Like, really, really good. It's been a bad week, but heck, I'm sure there is a light. Yeah, there's always a light at the end of the tunnel. There usually is. Sometimes you have a bad week. With what? It happens to I everybody. Had a bad week. Not a bad week. Like shit. Oh, it's been a bad week, but heck, I'm sure there's a light. Tessa, there's always a light. Sometimes you just have a bad week. What did happens. I miss? Hello, beautiful Hi, couple. Hi, Denise. All right, I don't Hello, even know. Hello, Dilshit. Hello, Noreen. Right Hello, Cat Mom. Oh, Zach Peters. Oh wow, that just came apart. Good night. All right, I'm guessing what happened. He you said, "Lame A F." <laughs> Yo mama. Yo mama's lame AF. Did someone block him already? I don't know. I don't think so. Good night. Have a good <clears> night, <throat> Zach. Hey, Vanessa. You guys Hello, make Vanessa. me miss being married. Huh. <laughs> huh. <laughs> Divorced, huh? <laughs> if only you were us. <laughs> Barbecue chicken Just for kidding. Pete. Hi, Vanessa. How are you, girl? In the pool. Burnt on the crisp. Day one of my holiday. Oh, at least you got the bean burned out of the way, Soul's mom. What's up, Dalton? <laughs> Hello, Iva. This is good. This Hello, is really Pamela. good. Hello, Dalton. That is... Hello, Trish. That's cheese. Yeah. So We don't do that here. I just picked it up, <laughs> and we don't do that here. <laughs> it's not that kind of show. Um... <coughs> So do you remember, and I'm sure every school is different, but do you remember, my school, when they would have Cheers, grilled Cheers, cheeses God. on, let's say, Wednesday, on Thursday and Friday, they would take all the leftover grilled cheese and cut them up into croutons and then rebake them so they would get hard. So they're like grilled cheese croutons. They were so freaking good. That's what was supposed to be topped on the bread bowl. But... 
Our air fryer is broken and Kaki didn't want to use the big fancy one. No, I don't want to. <sighs> I'm sorry. Then had to have an estate sale for all the all the stuff. I love watching y'all. Oh, Tessa, I'm happy to have you. Brandy does her thing. I love the food you guys eat. Well, thank you. How long have we been married or together? We've We're been together. Not married. We've been together for almost 15 years. I need to make that. I need to make that clear. We are not married. We're engaged. We're engaged. We've been engaged for like 13 years. 12 years. 12 years, 13 years, 15 years. I've, uh, I'm feeling better. I'm feeling better. I mean, I still have Paisley? like... That's a nice name. Paisley? She's in here all the time. I'm just saying it's a nice name. Yeah. Paisley? I'm f yeah, I'm feeling better. Um, I still have a terrible cough. So if you make me laugh too hard, yeah, I'm going to start hacking I can rub along. your head, right? I'm going back to rub your head. Nice and easy. Yeah, nice and easy. Why do you have to make that clear, LOL? Oh, because it's what we do. We are not, because when we actually do get married, it'll be that much more special when I come out and I say, hey, guess what, guys? We got married today. You know what I mean? Put a ring on. I got the ring. It's just, we don't got the paper. We got the ring, just on the paper. Yeah, we don't have papers. Well, passing bastards, that, that's not very nice. Been engaged for how long? Like 13 years. Yeah. I'm not ashamed of Kaggy. That's not why I'm saying we are not married. I want to make that clear. I'm saying that because the day we come out and make a video saying, hey guys, we got married, it's going to be a big deal. Like, holy crap, they finally did it. It's like, oh damn. They took the dive. They made that punch. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then six months down the road, we'll be like, there's the jinx. <laughs> That's why we waited so long. Maybe you we shouldn't have done it at all. Who knows? I don't now, know. This bread bowl is an Asiago cheese bowl. I'm hoping. Well, thank you. It smells really good. That's cool. I respect. I can't that. smell anything. I can't smell a damn thing. Really? Like this hot sauce? So you should. I can't smell it because my nose is so stuffed. Yeah, you, you should have saved calories and, and made that as lame as possible. If you can't taste, I mean, you might. I can't be able to taste smell it. it. I just I can't taste it. Don't do it, Khaki. Take my advice. <laughs> <laughs> so I was saying that. Iva, we listen. <coughs> listen, Iva. At the end of the day, you are just like me and Khaki do. And don't say you're not. You mess around and say all this stuff about your husband because mm. he's not in here. He's not listening. I can taste it though. But deep down inside, you love him. You love coming home and he's laying on the couch and maybe drinking a bush of beer. You know. She loves to like point him off on everybody else. Yeah. <laughs> You, you were like me and Kaki do. Just like me and Kaki do. I can tell by the way you talk to us. Earth to Caitlin, those no. bell pepper boats look fire. Thank you. They are. I can actually taste. I can't smell them, but I can taste. These are really good. Are, are there engagement ring in a wedding band from my fiance? Huh? Huh? I, didn't, I don't understand that. Love my man, but I don't like him most of the time. That's understandable. Iva, that's like khaki dude. She don't like me most of the time either. Listen, I don't like him when he doesn't put his clothes in the hamper. When I sit there and fold clothes, and then he tears through them like a damn tornado. Mm. Yeah, that's when I don't like him. That's when I get really pissed. I mean, good, though. Uh -huh. <laughs> what? You're about to be living out of a hamper. Because I'm about to be done for the I feel like I do live out of a hamper. I had to get my work clothes out of uh, a hamper. Oh, I'm this sorry. Morning. You know what? I spent five hours today, you know, with your aunt at her doctor's appointment. Yeah. Can that was fun. Maybe sinus infection? Yeah, I think it might be. Didn't realize I was so late. Late today has flew by. Well, hello, Prissy. Hi, we just Prissy. started. Yeah, we just started, girl. She gets pissed. He takes her makeup. Oh, no. He's, I, not, he's I, not allowed to touch that. I have my own makeup, Pete. <laughs> Come on, man. He's not allowed to touch mine. Mm -mm. You know that. <clears throat> Can you imagine, though? <laughs> Can you imagine that I, I needed to do... Well, let's let's go with this. What is something that you would always get that I would always use and you'd get pissed? I know the answer. I know what, what, what you know, you'd get pissed that I would use it. Because I would use so much. Oh, my freaking leave-in conditioner. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I use it tonight for the first time in a long time. My husband and I have been together 32 years, engaged 27, and married 5. There you go, Paisley. Very cool. There you go. 
Thank you for that. Everybody that says that you gotta rush and you gotta get married, there's no, it'll happen when it there's happens. There's no rush. Yeah, we are in no. Clearly, we're not in a rush. No. We're good. <laughs> Peggy knows I'm not going nowhere. I'm almost like 98% sure Peggy ain't going anywhere. Mm -mm. We already had this conversation. Jamie, the other night. Yeah, no. Jamie having his own makeup might be a sign, Gaggy do. Nah. Come on, Pete. Nah. I don't think so. Gaggy likes me like this. I think you like me like this, too. Don't you Hello, lie, Tracy. Brother, Who are you, girl? Wow, the hot sauce is actually clearing up my nose. Is <laughs> it? Yeah, I should probably pour some more on here. Well. Hola. I have to get the salt. Hello. How are you? Hi, Tracy. Do you need anything, Kagi? No. You think Parmesan cheese would have been good on that? Parmesan cheese? I don't know. I feel like there's enough cheese, but I do need salt. That is for certain. Hello, Diane. Diane, how are you tonight? Oh, that might have been too much. Let's try it though. I'm gonna do half the bread ball and then I'm gonna. That's go. not even your fault, only because that salt shaker was like clogged the other day, I guess, because we had like the windows open. Thank you, Pete. Humid. But, <laughs> if you're going to compare me to cereal, I would say I was like a cinnamon toast crunch. I was just gonna say that, cinnamon toast crunch. Yeah, cinnamon toast crunch, I think, suits me. What do I have in the bell pepper? There's scrambled eggs. Um, diced peppers, onions, um, bacon, it, and turkey know, sausage, cheese. I know what cereal it's I would delicious. give you. I put some hot sauce on top. Pete, if you were cereal, I know what you'd be. You'd be a frosted mini wheat. <laughs> Why? Yeah. Why? Not even a frosted mini wheat. I would give you. A, I would just make you a mini wheat. Uh, like a mini wheat. Hello, Caroline. A mini wheat. Hello, Caroline. I miss some. What are you guys grubbing on? I got it wasn't cereal. <laughs> <coughs> well, no shit. <laughs> wow. I'm still saying you're a frosted mini wheat. All right, let's get into the salad. This lentil needs something. Salt does help, but it's like. It's definitely missing something, and I'm wondering if I should have put more cheese on it because it tastes really good with the actual grilled cheese itself. Did I bake the bell peppers? Yes. I did bake the bell peppers before I put the scrambled egg mixture into them, only because I don't like a really hard bell pepper when I'm having, like, eggs in them. It's not like I'm hey, having Jimmy Jam. a salad in there. So I baked Jack them. Do. Did you see Jamie's new interview video that I sent you? Um, yes, I, I saw some of it only because I was in, you know, the hospital. <laughs> and I couldn't play it. <laughs> so there were interview? too many people were around. It was Tiger King. And oh, I couldn't play it. Come on, man. And I couldn't play it. Jimmy Jam. Mm. Uh, the official, what is that? The official Untamed Beast. I apologize. I'm sorry, we cannot take that. We don't take live requests. So I baked the bell peppers at like 400 for like eight minutes. Now I'm a honey nut cheerio. Flipped them over and baked them for another eight minutes and just let them cool on the pan when I took them out. And then once I filled them with the egg mixture, like after I cooked like the eggs and whatnot, I stuck them back in the oven with the oven off. South Dakota, hello. No, nah, pizza, no, nah, he's a honey nut cheerio. No. Nah. Frosted huh. mini wheat, 100% sure. And that, and you know, like and this go, anybody can chime cereal. in on this. If you were gonna describe yourself as a cereal, what would it be? I am for sure cinnamon toast crunch. Hello, Mr. Edwin. Jimmy Jam, my buddy. I'm confident enough to say he would be Captain Crunch. I would see I would see Jimmy Jam's a Captain, Captain Crunch, crunch? A peanut butter Captain Crunch. Yeah. I was just about to ask what kind of Captain <gasps> Crunch. Lake, Lake Michigan, beautiful Please souls. Please play. Thank I you. will play it. I'm gonna play it right now. A lot of things. They're looking amazing. I've tried them a couple. Oh, what the bell peppers? Okay, okay you'll die laughing. They're and really it's good. So Jamie in the video, he would so say it. I <laughs> promise you, even the die lame. Please play it. How long is it, Jimmy? Jamie's Fruity Pebbles. I could see me being Fruity Pebbles. Yeah. 
more so the cinnamon toast crunch. I mean, the fruity pebbles. It's colorful. I'd be lucky. I haven't said I'd be lucky charms because I'm a charm. You are, girl. You're my lucky charm. And I love you. Mwah. Oh. Chocolate Rice Krispies for you. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. What would I give you? What would be your I don't cereal? eat cereal. I know. That's why I'm trying to think. You'd probably be like one of those yogurt fruit bowls. I'd be like Special K. <laughs> Special K. There, there you go. go. Somebody come, used to come in here and call me Special K. Click on your feet, Kagadir. I'm feeling better, guys. I'm feeling better. Watch out. You're quicker on your feet than I am tonight. I'm like delayed. Because I'm feeling better. <laughs> hey there, Tracy Peep. It's 10 seconds long. No, no swearing. swearing. Okay, so play it real quick. Let's see what Mr. Jimmy Jam. Okay. Hold on. I have a judgment against me. I'm not changing the way I dress. I refuse to wear a suit. I've had some kinky sex. I have tried drugs. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. One. That last cereal I had a bunch of the notes. Jimmy Jim, that is that you're right. Oh my god. That was a good one. How are you, girl? You know what Tiger King? <laughs> I said don't make me laugh. I can't. Tiger, I can't. I'm going to die. Listen, Tiger King <coughs> is going to be like the, the soundtrack, right? To everybody's beginning of quarantine. That's what everybody mm -hmm. did. That's hey, what me Kelly. and Kaki did. Yeah, that's what we did. Quarantine started. We watched quarantine, Tiger King. 2020 Tiger King. And then the other movie came out, which was on um, Netflix, which I think it was Lost Girls. The ones about the Gilgo Beach murders. I didn't watch that. Yeah, you did. No, well, I, did. I made you watch it with me. Maybe you didn't pay attention, but we watched it. What was it about? The Gilgo Beach murders. How they were trying to find those girls that were murdered. They found all those dead bodies. Oh, I did watch that with you. I know. I enjoyed Tiger King. Is there rumor? There is. No, rumor. I'm feeling better, but I still got a nasty cough. Wow. This is better than this. Really? It's the chips. Jamie watched Tiger King and played with himself. Whoa, fancy bastard. You know, Pete, that's a that's a show, that's a documentary that I would Prissy. definitely get back into. Prissy lost 16 pounds. High five, girl. High five. Very good, Prissy. You go, girl. You go, girl. I love hearing that. <clears throat> what was I... I'm trying to think, Tiger King, because it took us, I'm not even playing with you, it took us, it would take us like two nights in a row to finish one episode. Do you remember? Because we always had to... We always had to stop it. Or like rewind it for some reason. I'm wondering why this tastes weird. I didn't put hot sauce on it. Good for you, girl. Prissy, Prissy, now, I know you've been doing your walks, right? What have you done in your diet? Like, did you take things out? Did you, were you just smart, weighed your stuff, counted your calories? Or were you just mindful of what you were eating? Noreen, you watched it in three days. Yeah, it took me and Kaki, yeah, like, us a, two weeks. Yeah, it took us a while. Two freaking weeks to watch that damn documentary. You guys are like the couple we hang out with on the lake. We love them. Cheers from Canada. Well, cheers. Brent? Is that your name, Brent? Cheers. Couple on the lake, huh? Yes, me. Valentina hot sauce. The best hot sauce ever. I mean, I do like Tabasco sauce, but ever since I found the Valentina, it's way better. You are secretly crushing I like it on so Jamie. much more. These tie-dye tights. Jamie, just don't let him corner you. Who, Pete? <laughs> um, it would be a dream come true for Pete. I'm telling you, he screenshots all the times I get up. And he's got like a collage of me getting up in my different color tights. Thanks here to help each other. Come on, Prissy, I'm glad I we could help you I would bet money out. on it. Hello, Felicia. Felicia, it would be great if you said something mean so I could go and say, Bye, Felicia. <laughs> I'm joking, I wouldn't. Bye, Felicia. Felicia's not gonna say anything. Frank's either. hot sauce is good. I was joking. Frank's, Frank's hot, hot sauce, sauce. yeah. I, you know what? Frank's is good, but I like the Valentina better. I don't feel like it has more flavor. 
I have never been a Frank's Red Hot sauce fan. Like, add to the bottle, never got into it. Walk two miles every other day, stop eating when full, not over full. Very good. California here, the next three weeks where I'm will be... It will be yeah. in the 100 degree range. Well, damn, stairs, that sucks. I wish I was running at 100 degrees today. Love the tie-dye shorts. Thank you, Tracy. They were tights, and then I cut them into booty shorts. And I walked today, but this is like the perfect weather for me to run. But I can't run. No, I know. Because I can't breathe. Because now I got this damn cold. And I wanted to run so damn bad because I'm like, oh, like this you is like... You should have just did it. I can't breathe. You want to be picking my body up on the side of the road? I'm just saying. <laughs> and hear me out. I can't breathe. I know. Then you stop. <laughs> and then you catch breath and you go back, you know? Like, you got it. Even before you got sick, I told you, you had to get back into it. I you know. You can't just have a, a, a good well, run. Well, first of all, it's easy for you to say you didn't gain as much weight that I did. So... Aggie, that's, but you know how to start running. Yes, that's I do. When I, when I started what? running, I was thinner. Way thinner. No. That's way not thinner. what I'm saying. I'm saying when you first had that run, you felt good. And you said you felt sore. And I said, you're going to feel like crap tomorrow. It's important... That you embrace it and feel like shit the next day and get used, get your body used to it. I'm not telling you to run straight. I'm just saying, keep up with it. So you, you that's what I, that's all I was saying. Mm. I'm from Texas and I'm up in Michigan for a few months. Uh, Cholula is nice. good too. I, I totally forgot about Cholula hot sauce. Who is the pillow Jamie placed on your face? Just, uh, uh, he yeah, he was helping you out. You know what it might have been. Do you remember me waking you up this morning? No. Around four o'clock in the morning? No. I woke Kaki up. I smacked her in the foot. <laughs> I'm like, Kaki, shh. And you're like, what? I'm like, you sound like a damn horse just snoring. <laughs> I hear shit. I smacked the bottom hoof. And you just, <laughs> you did that. <laughs> oh. And then Isabella is like right in the middle of us and she was cuddling with me. Running in short shorts feels the best. Yes, it does. You act like I'm going to remember what you did to me at 4 o'clock in the morning. Her I smacked her right in the hoof. You smacked my hoof. Meanwhile, you want to see his feet? He wants to call mine hoofs. Why? Well, Let's compare feet right now. Oh, even if you had the sexiest feet in the world, I'd still call them hoofs. They're hoofs. They're not hoofs. They're actually very nice feet. I take care of my feet. Smack the foot. I, you know... Uh, what did he? Yeah, apparently he smacked my foot. I don't know. I don't remember that. Can I, I do a Mr. Ed horse sound? I don't know what that mean, that, that sound is. Do you go to the doctor? You ever heard I, Mr. Head? No, I did not. I know go to the doctor. I've heard of Mr. Ed. I don't know what the sound he made. I did not go to the doctor because our son. I took our son to the doctor, and they said it was just a virus. They tested him for Corona, but it came back negative. So. It's obviously something that's just going around. Because now everybody else in the house has it. Yeah. Except me. You better knock on some wood. I don't need wood to knock on. Is that all you do is eat? Uh, yeah. And you've been muted quite a few times. Maybe it's time that you're blocked. I... Just I do, saying. I do other things than just eat. I do... I eat live on here every night, but... Uh, I hit the... Shit out of my hubby when he snores. Hey, Court. Well, there was it. this one time where Jamie was snoring like a goddamn bear. And I woke him up. He didn't do anything. Like, he was like, <laughs> rolled over and went back into his bear snore. I actually left the room, shut the door, went into the kids' room, shut their door, and still heard him through the door. So, <laughs> apparently, my snoring's not that bad. At least I stopped. Okay, I was like annoyed <clears throat> because of how loud it was. Like you never do that. I was I, tired, and first of all, I'm congested, so obviously I'm gonna snore. Oh, I know. I'm just saying. <laughs> I just I was shocked. I woke up and I looked over at you. <laughs> <laughs> Same. So you you've experienced that type of snoring, Marie. So remember, if I snore maybe once in a while. Remember how bad I was though. I was really bad yeah. at snoring. 
And I used to be able to sleep through it, and I can't anymore. I don't snore anymore. Not sometimes like I used you do. Though. No, sometimes you do. And sometimes it's really bad. I knew a guy who was a horrible snorer. Jimmy Jim, you're a snorer, right? I bet you snore loud. I would bet. Pete, you too. You snore when you're sick? You snore and you're like, well, obviously I'm going to snore. I can't breathe through my damn nose. Could have woken her up and drool and snot all over her face. Not really, <laughs> no. <clears throat> Jimmy said he's not really a snorer. Pete, are you a snorer? Watch like Pete say no, Jimmy say no, and then like all the girls who you would think is innocent and doesn't snore, like Trish. What kind of green juice do you drink before the meal? It's spinach. Mm -hmm. Straight spinach. Just straight spinach. Blend it up. Easy to go down. I was eating it raw uh, last night, but... <laughs> I could make a joke right now. Jason said she snores. It's got black out. You what? What over your head? Me? Yeah. I was eating it raw last night. Spinach? Oh my god, you didn't get it. It was a sexual joke. You didn't get it. You eating it raw. You... Somebody's gonna get it. Because I know I'm not the only dirty minded person in this room. I know I'm not. How are you gonna be dirty with spinach? <laughs> <It's>... <laughs> <Okay. All right. laughs> Cat mom got it. I guess it's just holding my head and I'm a light sleeper. <laughs> I lay in one position and don't move all night. Really? <coughs> I swear, Jimmy. You yeah, take... eating it raw is what, that's what I was going at, but he every, didn't get it. Every time I think I know, or I think I know something <laughs> that, uh, like I would guess that you would do, I'm wrong. Every time. Does your mom, <laughs> dad, watch your lives? Do that? No. No, 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 no. Um, I, I do have family that watches. Your mom used to watch the replay, but then she stopped. She stopped because, well, the, of the some sexual of the things innuendo. that we talk about, she's like, I don't want to know that. Well, yeah. <laughs> Don't watch it. <laughs> he missed this. What's up, Cortland? Who missed what? Oh, me. We're all hoo hoo, Jamie. He still did not get it. I'm sorry. I'm not that. Eat it raw. Yeah. What's who? How? Explain to me. What does raw? PG what way, does raw dog mean? I didn't say nothing about dogs. Raw dog and anything. I said eating spinach raw. You said I'm gonna eat it. I I was eating it raw. <laughs> You missed the joke. It went over your head. I know that. <laughs> I was talking about spinach, though. I know. Okay. <laughs> With our queen jersey, I was sick and dozed off. She heard me snore. It happens. But I've heard her accidentally snore, so it's fair in the snoring game. <laughs> Road dog is no rubber. Oh, I knew that. But guys, I'm talking about spinach. <clears throat> Hello, Mickey. I didn't see you in there before. <laughs> So, yeah, the salad was a lot better than the bread bowl. So eating it raw, not the spinach. <laughs> um. <sighs> Hi, Kelly. Hello, hello. How are you doing today? Tonight, actually? Hmm. Jimmy definitely snores. Yeah, I kind of figured he did, but yeah, most Chrissy. people that snore will, won't admit to it. I was off today. I spent a good five hours, you know, at the, uh, the yeah, doctor's what did you office. Do? At the doctor's office with your aunt, who was getting injections in her neck and her back. Well, what did you do for the five um, hours? I'm going to tell you. So, I picked her up at like 10.15. Took her to like the place. The doctor was two hours late to the appointment. Her appointment was at 11. Doctor didn't show up till almost one. Mm -hmm. I didn't get home till just before three. So I was sitting in a room with her aunt and we were, we were just talking. <laughs> Five out, wow. We were just talking up until the point they took her in to be sedated. And yeah. Then I, I sat outside and scrolled through TikTok. And got sucked into like you a TikTok. should have got walk in. Flat where? Well, where? Uh, there's not a parking lot? You walk in circles? I did that no, when I took my mom. I'm not for... gonna do that. First of all, I'm not gonna do that. First, I was wearing flip flops number one. Uh, I wasn't expecting to be there for that many I hours. I was gonna say, yeah, I would have been pissed. I wasn't expecting to be there for that many hours, so I just sat on the bench in the shade and scrolled through TikTok. They confiscated my water too, what? so because I couldn't bring it in. Oh. 
So I had like half a water. No, I'm dying of thirst. It's hot as shit outside. <clears throat> and I'm coughing like crazy. Like we were sitting in the waiting room before they called her back. Because they had to put the IV in and whatnot. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to go outside. I had to take my mask off because I was coughing like crazy. People were looking at me like, oh my God, she's diseased. Yeah, yeah I'm coughing because first of all, I'm wearing a mask and I can't freaking breathe. Yeah, now that I think of it, you probably should not have went today. That's why I went outside. So I went outside. I sat in the car, put the air on. And then they called me to come back in. I'm like, oh, it's over? And I go back in the room, and she's just sitting there in a gown. And she's got an IV in. And I'm like, oh, it's not over yet? And she goes, no, I'm waiting for the doctor. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm not eating this. <laughs> I'm <laughs> like, oh, shit. So huh. then we're still waiting for the doctor. We had, like, this one anesthesia person come in. And she had, like, no bedside manner at all. And, like, you maybe... finish it. You can finish it. I don't want it. And made her so freaking nervous. Like, yeah. She's like, yeah, well, we don't do, like, that type of anesthesia for, like, the neck. Because we don't want to go in too far and, like, paralyze you. And I'm just like, why wow. did you say that to somebody? Like, why would you do that? Hey, dude, I don't like this anymore. No, I don't, you're over. No, the, the, the lentil doesn't have any... It's not really pasta, guys. It's lentil. Canadian pizza stuff mm -hmm. here. I would love Two to try one doctor. of those New York pizzas you guys do. You're from Canada and you would like to try New York pizza? I've never had Canada pizza, so I can't compare it. But from what I hear, New York pizza is the bee's knees. Much, much better than Chicago pizza. But I've never had Chicago's pizza. I have had New York pizza. Have I seen? Yeah, of course I've seen Whitey Paisley. Um, I actually did a duet with Whitey. It's on my it's on my TikTok. So yes, I know who Whitey is. I follow him, and I check his page daily to see what he's posting. That lentil pasta is is for shit. Hmm. Damn it. I do it for the iron, Portland. There's not that much iron in it. And, well, that's why I bought it. And. Chicago pizza isn't real pizza, Trish. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, she's calling out Jimmy. Well, I'm the one that joked around. I've never had it. I know it looks good. I know it looks good. Chooch likes it. In your dreams, Trish, you're just mad because you want some. <laughs> <laughs> your favorite pizza in Arizona is called NYPD. New York Pizza Department. That's freaking cool, Sugar Nut. <laughs> that is cool very name, cool. Hey, listen, if I lived in Arizona and I walked past a pizza place called NYPD, you worry about the crime in New York City. Well, lately there's been a lot, but we've never seen it at the times that we've been there. I think they're asking us if we worry about the crime in New York City. Kagi's got my back. And what is the name of my page? Honestly, when it comes to New York City and its crime uh, issues, we, we stay generally in crowded areas. Johnson and Isabella. Oh, good takeover. She's having a bedroom. Yes, yeah, she is. We stay you, in crowded areas, and we don't really go party. <laughs> Sugar Nut, Jamie's new serial name. It is a cool... <laughs> It's a cool name. Oh. But instead of sugar not, it should be sugar, like sugar not, it should be sugar not. Gotcha. With like a K-N-O-T. I think that would be cool. Oh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm what? going to eat the last two M&M cookies considering I'm not finishing. Oh, well, there you go. Um, I don't think she's awake. I think she's moving around. Oh, man. Domino's Pizza is pretty much the closest we have in Canada for New York pizza. Really? As my Italian friends would say, New York pizza is fagazzi. <laughs> yeah, Jamie's going to eat some cookies. I've got two cookies left. And you know what I did last night. I got up and I had three cookies last night. I'm not going to shame myself anymore. I'm not going to... Uh, deprive myself from cookies um, during the week. No longer. I was telling uh, a sugar nut. Cat. <laughs> Makes sense. 
was telling her a couple hours ago, like, I'm, listen, I'm not going to be a bodybuilder. I'm not going to do anything that requires me to have my shirt off, making a living off my body. So why am I, am I going so strict on myself? Why am I, discipline I understand, I do, but if I want a cookie, I'm gonna eat a cookie. If I wanna have pizza on a Wednesday, I'm gonna have pizza on a Wednesday. It's just, it's just how it's gotta be going forward. As long as I can, you know, watch my calories, eat my vegetables, have fun, enjoy my meals, and run my ass off every single day, um, and stay dedicated to that, I think that will make me happy. And if I make body uh, adjustments along the way, great. If I don't, I don't. Our gas station is the best pizza here. Actually pretty good for price. 99 cents a slice, forget about it. Pete, really? I'm not, listen, hey. We're not gonna knock gas station food. No. I'm not gonna knock anything from a gas station. Honestly, some gas station things are really good. <laughs> Back in my day, you'd get a Four loco and some dick pills. You had yourself a Friday <laughs> night. Well, there you go. Thank you, Prissy, for the gifts, girl. Mm-hmm. Mwah, thank you. How far from New York City are you guys? We're in Queens. Yeah, not, we're not far, far, but we always get stuck in traffic. But the amount of traffic will make it seem like it's really freaking far. <sighs> you eat an hour a day? Sometimes less than an hour, sometimes more. Yeah, it depends. Depends on the day. I like those dollar pizzas. No, I never had it. Yeah, I never had we a never dollar had... pizza slice, like, ever. Like, it was never that cheap. No, I'm sure they're, they, they're, oh, they're... I'm sure they exist, We but... just have never seen it. We uh, just found we a really good pizza place that we're going to be, you know, is going to be our new New York City pizza place. Oh, my God, so good. I can't wait to try, like, something different the next time, just because... Right, that's dumb. What we had this past time was really good. Nothing to write home about those dollar slices. Here's the problem when me and Kaki go into the city. We go at night. And even though the city's open, a lot of pizza places are closing early still. Yeah, that's the only thing. Like, it really sucks because so everything we always is have closing to go, at like 10 o'clock. Yeah, we always have to go kind of snooping around. We stumbled upon that, uh, that, that place. Um, Mama Suprema. Pizza, Pizza Suprema. Suprema. I have the I have the uh, menu upstairs. I saved the menu. But it's honestly not. It's uh, like six, seven blocks maybe from where we start, which isn't bad. Hello, Princess Pants. Hello. Dinner's good. How are you, girl? Kaki did her nails. Looks good. Did you? Thank you. Well, I did them yesterday. I glued them on. I didn't do them. Glued them she on. did them. But thank you. Classy. Thank you. Classy girl. I had to like do something to make myself at least feel better a little bit. Well, hopefully you're pretty much 100% better tomorrow night. I painted my toes too. Did you? Mm hmm Today? No, yesterday. I feel bad you, you're going to work tomorrow. Know Listen, I went to work in like the heart of this hour. sickness, so. Chrissy, I know another streamer that does the one hour. A lot of people do it. The yeah. eating, eating one hour out of the day is not uncommon, especially these days. I am, Princess Pants. I'm feeling better than I was. I'm not 100%, but I'm feeling better. I don't feel like I'm dying, which is a plus. Your local place went under during COVID, Pete. I like the French manicures. Me too, and they're like my favorite. I feel like they're classic. Like these are just, these never go out of style. Hello, Lisa. How are you, girl? Hi, Lisa. His name is Joey. Joey. Whose name is Joey? Someone else that streams and eats an hour a day. Oh, a I lot of people do it. Yeah, we don't put a time on it. If it's an hour, some, it, sometimes it's over an hour. No, sometimes it's like 40 minutes, 30 minutes. Depends on what we're eating. Brooklyn, Harlem. Yeah, New York is a very... Uh, uh, Queens is in New York, it's yes. On it's on Long Island. A lot of people think, oh, Queens is the city. Queens is not the city. Queens is on Long Island. Manhattan is considered the city. Yeah. Me and my hubby have done the fasting for two and a half years now. Yeah, I, I, I think it works best for me. And, you know, and Kagi enjoys it too. 
However, lately we have not been as strict. <clears throat> Khaki eats during the day almost every day now. She picks. Nothing crazy, but picking can be can be dangerous, depending on what you're picking at. That, that looks, looks so, so appetizing. Well, thank you. It is. Yeah, yours does look good. It's really good. Mm. Well, this guy is actually a cool dude. Thank you. <laughs> did you have, let me ask you a question. What did you think you were going to get from me? Like, I know my videos, you, a lot of people, a lot of people that come in here and then we wind up talking to on a nightly basis. Usually, like, I like, was not expecting that. Picking apples is fine. LOL. Hello, Kelly. How can, how can I do it? I'm crazy. I just make sure I keep my things. calorie yeah. deficit. Well, Court, that's what you really just need to maintain is a calorie deficit. But Ah, what everyone thinks of the city is Manhattan. But Queens is part of New, New York, York city, city, too. But it's on Long Island. It's on Long Island. When I think of the city, I don't think of it being Queens. I think of it being Manhattan. Uh, I do the 24. 20 slash 4. Love you guys. Thank you, Mickey. Thank you, Mickey. Hey, Trish. Oh, now my nose is starting to run. What? My nose is starting to run. Oh. The hot sauce. Oh, Trish, I saw something you posted the other day that I meant to ask you a question on it. It's made up of multiple burrows. Yeah, it's a, it's a tricky little thing. You know how easy it is to get lost in Jersey from there? I used to go, I always used to have to we go. We used to get lost in Jersey all the time. Whenever, whenever I was wrestling in Jersey or had to go through the tunnel, I would always get lost. Every, no matter how many times I did it, I would always get lost. When I think of Queens, I think of Jamie. Ah, oh, well, thank you, Pete. <laughs> I wish I had more cookies. But I don't. Mm, you hear me? I'm getting those again next week. Because what I do I haven't had those in so long. It was like a it was like a it was like a, a spur of the moment buy. I was wondering why you bought those. I don't know. Yup, that's the tourist for you. You being local. I know the vibe and perspective. It's the same here in Chicago. They all think it's all about downtown when it's not. <laughs> I eat meat, just not as much uh, as districts, but like one sixteenth of, of New York. Yeah, you know it's funny. <coughs> Generally, people that are from New York don't know much about New York. That's the truth. Would you concur, Trish? Sorry about the island Islanders guys. Oh, we're not hockey fans. No. We're not we're not sports fans. Mm -hmm. You want to visit Montreal, Dalton? The only reason I know so much about like Long Island and the city is like when I was in college I took like a night class. From Montreal. I had to take a history class, so I took history of Long Island. Let me tell you it was like the cheapest class I've ever taken. It was like a dollar map. Yeah, I can't and wait. Then I can't you wait, just Jimmy. sit there and li listen to like the professor lecture about all of the things on Long Island, you just had to take notes. That was it. It was like the easiest class to pass. And it was the cheapest, too. You didn't have to buy a textbook, nothing. Like a dollar map, boom, done. Most New Yorkers don't do the tour stuff, yeah. But I've been doing it lately. Might as well enjoy my city. There you go, Trish. Well, there you go, Trish. That was also a part of a class where you had to, like, go to, like, different towns and explore, like, what they had to offer, like, historically. So you guys which like I enjoy things like that. No, nah, we don't really. I, I don't mind sushi. I don't like sushi. I don't um, eat fish. I've had sushi twice, and both times it was called discount sushi because I got it at a supermarket and it was going to go bad, so they put on it half off. That was the only two times I've had sushi. Excuse me. My ex was from Yonkers, Ghetto Square. My, met her in California. She said that she rarely left her. Her town? Neighborhood. Neighborhood? So I've, I've never had real sushi. I've had discounted sushi. So. But my brothers eat sushi all the time. Mm. And he, they, it always does look good. Oh, court sister married a, banker. a nice banker. Nice. Think, That's awesome. You think? 
Hey, if I told you my occupation was a fancy banker in Manhattan, would you believe me? LOL, who was that? Question mark. Who's who? Oh, that was Antonio. Who? Antonio. Who the fuck is Antonio? Your brother. Oh. Yeah, he comes in and out every <laughs> once in a while. Discount Sushi sounds like Jamie's old stage name. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Discount Sushi over Cinnamon. How about it? Discount sushi. You know what's funny? I fell upon like this TikTok today, like this account, where all he did was find mansions, knock on the door, and ask them what they did for a living. I just saw something on that. I just, I freaking fell into like this TikTok thing today, and I freaking, I fell right into this guy's like hands, and I clicked on his, his, you know, account, and I just kept scrolling and scrolling and scrolling and scrolling. And like, this one girl was just like, oh, yeah, I'm a porn star. Oh, wait, no. No, I'm in marketing. And he goes, oh, really? She goes, no, I'm just really a porn star. And <laughs> just shuts the door on him. <laughs> Oakland versus Yankees. But apparently, like, he's, like, big and up and coming on, like, TikTok. I just saw that. He, I fell into, the, like, like, the, the TikTok, news, you I know, time it, warp. But... I fell into the TikTok time warp, and I started, like, I followed him, like, all through Miami, all of these, like, mansions, like, it was So crazy. his videos are just him knocking on strangers' oh. doors, asking what he does, what they do for like, a living? hey, you have such a beautiful home. Can I ask you what you do for a living? And then they say, like, what they do for a living, and he's like, well, that's awesome. Seems like you're doing well, and that's the end of the, so, sometimes they invite him in, like, if they recognize him, like, oh, you're that guy from TikTok, come on in, take a tour. Really? Yeah. You follow? Not all the time. Yeah, I just follow him today. Yeah, you gotta show yeah me. the TikTok rabbit hole. Yeah, I fell in that hard today, Jimmy. Really hard. <laughs> Who are you with, Rambo? Question mark. Rambo. Yeah, actually, somebody in you know, Jamaica called him that. Yeah. Hey, Rambo. You hey, want Rambo. Me to do let me hair? do your hair. <laughs> hey, Rambo. You let me braid your hair. <laughs> Years ago, like 2009, that happened. Who was one a penthouse and the guy was a traitor? Oh yeah. One was a penthouse. Yeah, I just saw that one. And what? A guy was a trader? And he was just like a stock trader. Oh, trader. That's what he did. He was a trader. But he had this beautiful penthouse. Oh, my God. And then, like, in his bedroom, like, the ah, TV. I've seen him, Sugar Nut. The guy that expenses the people, goes to the people with the expensive cars. Is he the same guy? Though? Uh, I yes, I think he is, too, because there was some of that on his page as well. But, like, this, the one with the penthouse, like, the TV came out from underneath the bed, came up and flipped. So yeah. the TV was, like, at the end of the bed. And then he had, like, this beautiful car. Hello, Pam Rose. I was like, damn. Okay, I'm done. I'm so done, too. You, you don't want to finish your tots? You can have them if you want. I don't want them. I'm, I'm full. All right, so that's Jamie gonna... is an accountant in the cinnamon agency. There you go. <laughs> there you go, Court. There you go. I got to shave my beard, though. I got to trim my beard down. It's getting a little bit too heavy. Mm -mm. The top, the mm -mm. mustache, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, all right. Not Just the rest of bit. it, though. No. Never again. I keep Xing out. <laughs> need the oh, yeah, creation. with the champagne vending machine. I was like, damn, I need that. Like, I would love that. Hello, Jennifer. And he had a he had like a security guard in his in his actual penthouse. That was Mem pretty cool. Remember, Richie Rich had a McDonald's in his house. Yes. How cool is that? That is cool too. If you like McDonald's, <laughs> I'd have a Burger King in my house, but that's just me. Or maybe a Taco Bell. I, I would, don't know. I would do a Taco Bell and McDonald's. Taco Bell, Wendy's. I don't know. I'd have to like really think about it. What's his name? Kimmy. I don't remember his name. I don't, but um, I can always go back and send you it. I can like send you like one of his TikToks. I don't remember his name off the top of my head. I would also have a designated studio for adult actresses to perform their uh, talents and make videos, and I could just come in and watch anytime. One one of the girls that opened the door, she's like, "Well, I'm on OnlyFans." <laughs> <laughs> she's like, "I got my OnlyFans. Get the fuck out of here now!" Shuts the door in his face. <laughs> I feel like some of it may be staged, or like maybe he like knocks on the door previous, well, like he prior. Does. He has to, to obviously because, to be like, hey, look, yeah. this I'm doing this for TikTok. This is like what I do. Yeah. 
and they most likely know who he is. He's got to show his credentials, meaning his his following yes. and his views. Obviously. And if it's gonna give them some sort of publicity, they're definitely going to do it. Uh, can you do? Yeah. You ready for bed? Yes. All right, guys. I'm gonna we work will tomorrow. See you tomorrow. I want to go to work. Have a good rest of the night. If you do have to go to work tomorrow. <coughs> Fill up your flask in the morning to help you get through the day. Do whatever you gotta do to Fill get through the day. Fill up that flask. I've gotta get one. I'm remember, lacking. I'm lacking a flask. Remember, it's only eight hours, twelve hours if you if it really sucks. Hmm. Unless you're a doctor, and then you do it, and you're doing a double double Thank you, uh, Mickey. duty, two hour or two uh, twenty four hour shift, and I'm sorry, that sucks. It's a long day. It's a really long day. I want you know what I want. What? When we have nights like this where we're saying goodnight, but we're still talking, I want a button that I hit it, and then the playoff music goes, like the, like the news. Like, all right. <laughs> like the show's over? The show's over, and then me and you, ah, da, 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 and then we just click the button. Fill it up. That's right. Fill it up. Remember Anchorman? When they hit the button, and they're it's like, oh, you're going to go fuck yourself. <laughs> I'm going to start going to work with a wine bra. Yeah. Oh, my bra. They actually make those, and I'm go going to invest in them. Like Ozzy and Sharon, but you guys are real, not crazy. Good stuff, both of you. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Ozzy and Sharon. <laughs> All right. Except we don't curse that much. Good night. Not anymore, we don't.